Phillips Curve by Will Roberts and Carter Jacobs Period 4 Inflation and unemployment have an inverse relationship. When there is high inflation, there will be low unemployment, and vice versa, as shown by this formula. Ta-da! To label the Phillips curve, start by labeling the x-axis UE for unemployment and the y-axis pi for inflation. The short run Phillips curve is a downward sloping line and the long run Phillips curve is vertical. Under the long run Phillips curve is the natural rate of unemployment labeled NRU. When a point shifts along the Phillips curve, it is a mirror image shift of aggregate demand on an SAD graph. For instance, if aggregate demand shifts to the right, the point on the SRPC shifts to the left towards high inflation. Likewise, when the short-run aggregate supply shifts, short-run Phillips curve shifts in a mirror image, but this time the entire curve shifts. For instance, when the short-run aggregate supply shifts to the right, the short-run Phillips curve will shift to the left. Thank you. On the Phillips curve, inflation is shown by a point to the left of the long-run Phillips curve. A recession is shown by a point to the right of long-run Phillips curve. Examples. When resource costs increase, short-run aggregate supply decreases, causing the short-run Phillips curve to increase. When the economy is in inflation and aggregate demand decreases, the point will shift from left to full employment. Thank you. Thank you.